Welcome to Gaming with Bare Hands. I'm Bare Hands, and bringing you a Clash Royale video today, a little bit similar to the Graveyard Freeze deck we were playing not too long ago. We are going to throw a bit of a spin on it. Actually got beat by a deck very similar to this and wanted to give it a try myself. Having a little difficulty getting used to the change in pace for the playstyle because I've kind of been playing a little bit faster paced decks. And this one is definitely something you need a lot of patience with to slow it down, kind of get that death demon push of destruction in overtime. Have you ever had a day that just seemed like it would never end? I've been working kind of construction on a house that I'm building for 13 hours today and it is pretty late and I definitely want to get something up for you guys. I got to catch up on my clash time, you know, now that I'm home. I'm just going to do that with you. I played one game before this and lost pretty miserably. So hopefully that just gets the losses out of the way and we're just going to do nothing but win tonight. Who knows? Maybe I could get some of those crowns for my crown chest here. Okay. Uh, what I'm going to do in the beginning here is kind of see if we can't get something for him throwing down on the field here to come toward our tower. Uh, goblins aren't going to be what I'm looking for. Uh, there is a hog goblin. I'm going to go ahead and throw this down and then pull the hog over the, to the tower. He freezes. Unfortunately, the tornado doesn't have enough time with that goblin to kill it, and he is going to kind of do a bit of damage to our right hand tower but I'm okay with that uh, seeing as we have an activated king's tower now hopefully we could hold that rushy hog thing at bay uh, let's go ahead and throw down the executioner uh, get the ice golem down Uh, I am going to throw the Miner down. There we go. Miner grabs the attention of the Tesla and the tower, so it's going to die pretty fast. And let's pull this hog over. And then as the hog gets pulled, let's go ahead and throw the Electro Wizard down here. That should kill all of that. It's a pretty hefty amount of elixir. Let's throw the minions down. I would imagine he wants to throw his princess down. Uh, I am right on that. Let's go ahead and get the executioner down then. I don't like the executioner as a counter there, but I didn't really have that many options. Let's go ahead and get the miner going. He is going to have enough to get the Tesla down again, which is going to shut down our executioner. Goblins are going to come in here. I'm low on Elixir, so when he comes in with this hog, pretty much all I have for it is the tornado. Okay, I know the hog's going to come, so let's go ahead and throw the... Ooh, there it is. Ske ske skeletons! They're all going to die. His arrows, that's an interesting play. Let's go ahead and throw down the executioner. Go ahead and minor this princess. I might have actually thrown that a little too... Yep, it is going to get the princess. Melting that. Let's go ahead and get the graveyard going now. Electro Wizard. Tornado. That didn't, that didn't do quite as much damage as I would have liked. Let's go ahead and get the minions down here on the hog. Hog. Oh, no. I don't know. what What is the ice golem going to do there? Thankfully, our King's Tower is activated because we, we could have lost our tower there completely. Let's start up a really slow pack of push here. Yikes. Kill that princess. Okay, princess is dead. Graveyard's going. Electro Wizard's down. Tornado. Ugh, not, not going to be able to get to that tower in time. Uh, I know the hog's coming, so let's go ahead and throw down another P.E.K.K.A. I'm going to Miner on his princess. Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, I needed to get, I needed to get to our tornado, and I used it. 
over on his tower when I, defi I definitely shouldn't have used it there. It didn't do a whole lot of good. Couldn't get our graveyard to work. He had that Valkyrie. He had those goblins. Pretty spectacular shuts downs. Shuts? Pretty spectacular shutdowns to the graveyard. And that Freeze Hog just... I needed to wait for the tornado and use it on the hog and hopefully lesson learned. We got another a YouTuber here. Um, I'm gonna throw my Electro Wizard in the bed. Whoa! Okay. Okay, hit that balloon. Shut that balloon down. That was some fancy footwork right there. Uh, minions uh, are gonna do an excellent job of countering our graveyard. A little, a little too prompt on the graveyard there. Let's go ahead and executioner. Kill all those minions, please. Kill the minions. Okay, uh, Lumberjack is going to go ham dog on our tower there. Yikes. Interesting deck. Lumberjack, Balloon, Electro Wizard. Ooh, hmm. I like that. Let's take care of this. Take care of the balloon with the minions. Uh, I liked that shutdown. That was pretty good there. I want to go in with the graveyard right now. Oh, but he's going to draw it around. Nice. Nice work. I like that. That was, a, that was a really good play on his part. I'm going to throw my Electro Wizard down to take care of these minions. Now that he's used his minions, though, let's go ahead and uh, let's go in here. He's going to throw his Electro Wizard down. Our Electro Wizard, full health, is going to lock onto that tower. Then we're going to kill his. And he's kind of in a predicament here. His tower is going to take a ton of damage from that. We should be able to shut this down with the P.E.K.K.A. pretty well. All right. Woo! Oh, I see. I see what he's trying there. All right, I'm. Gonna, I'm gonna preemptively go in here against this tower. Uh, may I? I think I went a little bit too hard there. Overextended just slightly. I'm gonna throw in the miner though because I believe this is the end. Yeah, it's it's a really it's a really hard life doing balloon against a balloon clone nonetheless against a an execution or tornado combination cuz tornado is like the ultimate shutdown to the clone and the executioner is just really good with the electro wizard mind you against the balloon. So kind of hard counter situation there. I need to get a 3 crown is what I need. Give me them crowns. Um, kind of thinking executioner in the back might be the best option here. Uh, we're going to, we're going to opt for the lower elixir and throw the electro wizard down with, with this deck. I probably would. A little too high voltage there. I should switch lanes in this instance, but since he threw his lightning down, I'm going to get our executioner running in the back here he's two elixir lower than us so let's go ahead and graveyard that's too close to his king's tower uh when he minions here let's pull his minions up here to the front didn't work quite how i wanted it to <clears throat> all right let's uh electro wizard Minions. Ice Golem. Oh, that was beautiful. 
Uh, I almost minored there, but I need to save back up my elixir. His arrows are going to be forced out there, and we have... Uh, now that we know that he's running a Lava Hound deck, I feel pretty confident here. Uh, I'm going to go here because he'll probably throw minions on the right side, anticipating my miner. Exactly. Uh, I like that because what's going to happen now is the minions are going to come rolling in. We can throw our Executioner down. Okay, good play on his part. Uh, I'm going to throw the graveyard anyways. Let's pull this back. Ah, oh, I missed it. <laughs> the shadow, man. Okay, <clears throat> I'm going to throw minions down so that he can't lightning. There are the arrows. Now I'm going to throw this down. Then I'm going to throw this down. Then I'm going to throw this down. Come out, distract that. Oh, the lightning hurts. Uh, thankfully, our Executioner is not going to get taken out there, though. And let's go ahead and throw down our Miner. Miner couldn't catch the Electro Wizard in time. Electro Wizard. Executioner. <sighs> this is bad. This is real bad. I used my... Uh, Oh, I used my tornado. Come out. Oh, and the tor- I missed again! That's too rushy. That's too rushy right there. Oh, and his arrows take out our tower. Good game. What did I use my tornado on before? Why? That's what, what I'm doing. What I'm doing, if you plan on using this deck, you have to be a little bit more picky uh, and realize what you need the tornado for. Clearly, I needed the tornado for that balloon uh, as he was able to lightning out our stuff and probably needed to space things a little bit differently for the lightning. If I was playing this deck regularly, that sort of thing would start to ingrain into my mind as to where to place things when to use the tornado right now i'm just kind of throwing it down learning it while i play with you guys uh, so hopefully if you watch this and want to try this deck out for yourself i'm kind of helping you learn what not to do with some of these cards i think we could do one more uh, and then i need to go to bed let's do the electro wizard in the back see i need to wait and let him do the first play Mm. Yeah, see, if I had waited for him to do the first play, I could have done the P.E.K.K.A. farther back first to counter the Giant. I feel like he needs to play something else here. What's going on? Kang? Are you, are you here? Well, we said we wanted three crowns. And uh, I think we're going to get one. Mikito, throwing that miner, giving us that king pop. Uh, now I'm going to match that same side, go ahead and throw our beefy P.E.K.K.A. down now that he's got an ice wizard coming this way. Oh, I thought I threw the executioner down, apparently not. Executioner hit those fire spirits. Wonderful. 
Um, I'm gonna throw the graveyard down now. Oh wow, the minions didn't die. I'm gonna throw the ice golem down here. We do enough damage for all of that to have been worth it. So that was good. That was a good play. Now we need to just calm it down here. Play really defensive. Get the Electro Wizard in the middle here. We take quite a few hits on the tower. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just back this up with the Miner. Tower's going to reset everything. Guards are going to get melted by the minions. And then we're going to do a ton of damage to the tower. Okay. This is good. Nice counter push is happening here. I'm going to throw... Executioner in the back here. Okay, double elixir. Let's go ahead with the Pekka. Let's go ahead with the graveyard. Ooh, look at that. Throw that one more time. Ice Wizard's gone. Getting some good damage off on the tower again. Let's go ahead and throw this Executioner down preemptively because now we're going to have a stream of units coming in here. We go ahead and take care of the Fire Spirits, uh, which was the biggest threat there. And now let's go ahead and get the... He's at a disadvantage because his Fire Spirits are just kind of running into our tower and dying. All right, going into overtime. Let's get this graveyard down. Overtime is happening currently. Executioner is helping out. Mini Pekka's taking shots. Let's pull these minions away. Tower's gonna drop. And we clean that game up. Good game, sir. Well played. Uh, good job, Makito. I think with some practice, this deck will rock. It is a lot of fun. You can kind of bait out a defensive counter push and then drop a P.E.K.K.A. Executioner and shut it down. You could play really nice defense with that Tornado combination, some some tricky rushes with the Ice Golem Graveyard slash Electro Wizard with the Miner. It's got some really awesome concepts. Thanks for sticking it out with us while we learned through the beginning stages of this deck. And... Thanks so much for stopping in for this video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Can't wait to see you in the next video. Wherever you are in your day, make it awesome. See you next time.